Can you tell me, um, did you make this uh, compilation of, of, of short performance-based films, especially for this screening, or do we consider this as one film? Well, essentially, I consider them as uh, statues. Right? They are, um, they are s supposed to be shown in, uh, on monitors mm -hmm. in space, and each head is supposed to be a sort of sculpture. Or, uh, so normally you show them separately. Yes, I prefer that. I showed it once like that, and uh, I would like also to show it here. I think it fits also the cinema space because it refers to some. Uh, I, I've recognized some, some, yeah. some, some characters. Of so. Cinema. I would prefer to see them on each on a, on a monitor, but I think it can work like this also. Mm -hmm. um, how many perform? How does it work? Do you normally make a lot of performances as statues, record them, and then decide whether you want to show them, or is everything you do as a sculpture ready to be shown to the world? No, I'm I'm very critical. I mean, I have a lot of movies that I that I haven't shown or that I decide not to show. I also thought of not showing this uh, the last film, mm -hmm. but I thought it's interesting to see a bit the difference from the earlier films that they were just crops of the heads, and this had to do more with an object and not um, well, not a character or not some kind of a heroine. That it became more. Um, well, more statement a bit on an art object or an object as such, and not just a face or something mm -hmm. in, the, in the mind. Mm -hmm. <coughs> but the concept of the chair somehow. Mm -hmm. So it but became externalized from uh, from myself. Yeah, I'm, I'm actually very interested in uh, the whole process before the recording. Is yeah. it something... Do you give yourself like an assignment that you make a sculpture every day, <coughs> day like Erwin Willem, for example? No, not really, and I don't. I, I don't really plan them. Or it's if I feel like doing something like this, I just do it. You set up the camera and you do it. Yeah. Do you also make performances without the camera? No, not really. I'm too shy for that. I think. Yeah, no, but you can also do them for yourself and not show them to the world. <laughs> yeah, my whole life can be also regarded as a performance. I don't know. Mm -hmm. But these are more like created statues which they refer to art and to to cinema to cinema and to kind of a collective uh, consciousness uh, or what we know of cinema or what we know of art what mm -hmm. and to uh, some kind of a hero in this or an anti-hero mm -hmm. in these worlds um, although i'm still puzzled about the sheep is the that sheep, also yes. the, the sheep is that also a film hero i couldn't no, they're not all film heroes, uh, okay. I mean, no. Well, for the rest, I, I thought I... Some I, of them, yes. Uh, uh, but, well, most of them deal somehow with the, 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 the male hero or the masculine hero. And the sheep is also more from uh, mythology or religion. I mean, it's just a source of inspiration. Mm -hmm. You didn't... To take the characters and to appropriate them to the, to, for the film camera, for the sculpture, for whatever you call it. No, oh, I thought you made that one just before you came here, because you shaved... No, 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 it's from uh, <laughs> a year or two years ago. Okay, no. good. Thank you very much. Is there someone from the audience who would like to yeah, ask something? Okay. Yeah. I wondered, uh, did you um, uh, on purpose uh, loop some and some you repeated? I thought you repeated yourself yes. and some you looped. So why was that, I wondered? Yes, I was experimenting with some kind of duration. Uh, of course, I'm interested in the repetition of it and the kind of state of mind that it brings to the viewer. But sometimes I wanted to experiment just with a certain change of voice yeah. or a certain change of light or s something in the duration itself and not that it's just uh, a yeah. moment repeating itself all yeah. the time. Okay. If you show them a monitor, you, you, you normally bring them all together in one space? Or well, no, some of them belong to an exhibition I did that were concentrated on animals, on different animals. Mm -hmm. So that was more an animal space, kind of, or you can say a zoo or something like this. Others are more cinema-based. So, I, And the last one of the chair, it's more, well, it doesn't relate to the other ones so mm -hmm. much. And it's less a sculpture for me. For me, it reminded also a lot to horse riding, in a way. Yes, of course. Uh, so also cinema. But also to this cowboy and to this no, Western movie, exactly. kind of, and no. me being this West, so-called Western um, hero or something. Mm -hmm. The cowboy disappearing into the, into yeah. the background. Thank you very much. You're welcome.